From Critics Corner, keeping everyone up to date in film, I'm Dubious2020. Continuing our look into foreign films, this week I want to introduce you to an Asian film from 1995 called The King of Masks. When you watch a movie, you expect to see elements presented which not only develop the story, but introduces us to characters that we may grow to love and even hate. Some of these elements will leave you in tears, some welling in laughter, while others tug at your heartstrings leaving you with an emotional connection to the characters on screen. And on those rare occasions, you may get to see all of these elements represented in one film, and that film is King of Masks. This movie is about a man with great talent driven by a desire to bring happiness and joy to everyone around him. A man who struggles to continue every day even after great loss. A man on the brink of losing himself in an ever-changing culture bound to forget him. I found myself, at first, having no empathy for the main character or his plight. That is, until he meets the child that would change his destiny forever. This child, who hands out hope, love and compassion like leaves falling from a tree, changed my perspective of the film dramatically. While watching this, I found myself forgetting about the struggles and uncertainties presented in my everyday life. That's not to say that they won't be present after the credits roll, only that during this film I was able to allow those issues to subside for a while. This is a testament to how well this film was presented. So if you want to snuggle with your significant other or maybe just have a laugh with your family all the while introducing them to a cultural film rich, vibrant and full of emotion then this is the film for you. Every character here is presented in such a way that you can't help but fall in love with them. Each are unique in their own right, but here they're represented as delightful, fun, and engaging. During the course of this film, I found myself riddled with laughter, sometimes with tears, while I ultimately left with a feeling of joy and happiness. So sit back, grab some popcorn and tissues, and enjoy an emotional film full of laughter and hope. You won't be disappointed. For Critics Corner, keeping you up to date in film, I'm Dubious2020. Till next time, See you on the couch.